Okay guys, so today we're gonna be running lucky a little bit. It's gonna be a little bit different than usual, but I guess it's gotta be done. Come on out here, Lucky. Come on. Here, here. So what in the world am I talking about? Gonna have to do something, but I really don't want to. Well, let me tell you about it. So what I have to do is I have to do schoolwork out in the woods. Now, would I rather be doing schoolwork at school? No. Would I rather be in the woods just hunting? Yeah. But can I mix the two? I guess I can, but I, I don't know about it. Ain't gonna be too fun. Let me tell you the situation. So, am I homeschooled? No, I'm not. I go to a public school, in high school, full time, five days a week, on a normal week. But th for the last two weeks, what's happened, everybody's been sick. So like, because everybody's sick, they've been calling off school so that more people don't get sick. So, but what they do instead is they give us NTI days, I believe it is, non-traditional instruction something like that what it is is all the teachers give us work to do at the house but it counts as a normal day so we don't have to make it up in summer but still i don't want to be out here working whenever i get a day off i want to get a day off i was thinking i can sit in the house and do it or i can come out here on the mule sit here work and just let lucky run around like she's doing right now find me a squirrel lucky but yeah, guys, we're going to get on into it. And I'm going to show you what I got to do. Go out the binder. Now, we're going to open this sucker up. And you see all these papers? I ain't even kidding. You see all those papers? Look at them. They all have been done. Hey, that's awful, guys. My school ain't fun, I'll just tell you. So, what I got to do? I got to do day two. I've already done day one. This is the second day. But the task. Do people need silence in their lives? Plan and write an essay in which you develop your point of view on this issue. So yeah, that's what I gotta do right now. Do people need silence in their lives? Well, a lot of y'all know I come out here in the woods. The woods is silent, but a lot of y'all have called me out on it whenever I go hunting. I'm not silent, and that's probably why I don't kill anything. But anyways, guys, I'm gonna hit up this and start writing. That ain't fun, but I gotta do it. You don't need it. You find a squirrel. Well, guys, there it is. A two-page paper about how people need silence in their lives. Now that I got that done, I can finally get out here and do something. So, But, yeah, I'm going to get out of here and get into something because I can't sit here in silence much longer. Okay, guys, two videos ago, I asked y'all for suggestions how to train her. I read all the comments. I tried going squirrel hunting. I don't know why, but I just can't kill a squirrel lately. I don't even know where they are. They must have moved out or something, but hopefully we can get some squirrels later. But another thing I saw a lot was making sure she's not gun shy and feeding her while I shoot a little bit of a 22. Now, I don't, I really don't. I don't think she's gun shy at all. I don't think she will be. I think I can shoot a whole clip and I don't think she'll care. But just in case, I may be wrong too. Just in case, I'm going to feed her. Right here, I'm gonna do it in the woods, you know, just cause, you know, I like being in the woods, I guess. But I'm gonna feed her this dog food, fire off a few shots, and hopefully she don't care. There's just some food to eat. I'm gonna fire this in a safe direction. Yeah! Yeah! Woo! Good food, ain't it? Keep eating. Good food. Yeah! She ain't running away, so I guess that's pretty good. Eat it. Eat it. Eat it. It's good. It's good. Yeah. Yeah, it's good. Hey, now. That's food. Can't be scared of food. Mm, that's just a loud noise. Nothing to be afraid of. Ready? I'm gonna pop him. I'm gonna pop him. I'm gonna pop him. Look. Honey, find that squirrel. Find it. Find it. 
Good job. I don't think she's gun shy, guys. She's not eating anymore, but guys, she has literally never seen a squirrel in her life. And whenever I shot that gun, she was already looking up in the trees ready for it to fall out. So I guess that's a good sign, ain't it? Yeah. Yeah. Let's go find a squirrel. Guys, I've shot this gun once before and I had some people ask what it is. What this is, is a Mossberg 207 Plinkster. But, uh, to be honest, guys, I bought this at Walmart, like, a few years ago. I think it's like, 119, 109, something like that. But, uh, you know, it's a good little automatic rifle. Probably not the most accurate, but, I mean, I've killed squirrels with it. I've killed birds with it. Sorry if you don't like that. But, hey, I like coming out here, getting some of the cheapest ammo I can find, and just come out here and throw lead around, you know. You know, because whenever I'm squirrel hunting, I like to use CCI because they're a little bit more accurate. So I come out here with these. I buy these in like the big box. These are just regular federal solid points. You know, just come out here and sling bullets around and have fun. And train a dog with them. Ain't that right? Okay, guys. Well, Lucky's over there hunting. And uh, this gun has a 10-round magazine. I'd say if we want to go aftermarket, I could probably find something that held more. But I'm going to empty this clip as fast as I can. I'm just gonna go like this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit fire it like. And I'm, don't worry guys, shooting straight into the bank. Here we go. Here we go, and. All right. First one was a dud. Ready guys? Pretty fast, you know. Lucky over there didn't even flinch, just keep on hunting, that's the way she should be. She ain't a gun shy dog, guys. But yeah, I'm probably going to walk around with her a little bit more, fire a shot off, ah, uh, maybe once every five minutes or something, just let her know that they're normal, which she don't care about them, she's done good today. So yeah, there's the first step of training her, she's not gun shy, now I just have to try to get my hands on a squirrel or something, maybe a, just a good squirrel tail if I can find one laying around. I should have one, but you know, I looked this morning and couldn't find one. Now what I really need to do is either catch a live squirrel, kill a dead squirrel, and show it to her. Or, maybe I can get her out here early one day, and there'll be squirrels out here stirring around. Which, like I said, I've really not seen many squirrels in, like, the last month. So I don't know if they just move out to different trees in different times of season, or if they're just staying up in their dens a lot longer since it's got cold real quick. But, either way, you know, I'm just going to have to find her, get her on some squirrels, and hopefully we can get her treeing some squirrels it's sad because squirrel season's about over though she kind of spilled all the food why'd you have to do that so i know this has been a lot of videos in a row just about this dog i'm not quitting hunting or anything i'm just you know I just got this dog and I've been putting quite a bit of my time into her, so. This definitely won't be the last time you see her, but she probably won't be the star of the next video. It's untelling what the next video will be about, but, and Lucky is signing out.